Hi guys, this is Murat from mg2s.com and in this video I wanna show you one of the very useful tool that can help you in many ways. This tool can help you make your drawing faster and easier and that's a dynamic tool. You can find it in our in the bottom side or right here dynamic input. If you can't see this icon here, it's probably hidden and you can open menu that located on the right bottom side this menu and check dynamic input as you can see it's check it already and that's why we can see it here well let's see how it works if you will call some drawing tool like line well you you will see that on the right side of the cursor you can see command that we need to do specify first point and two additional field that we can enter parameters of the action well uh, we can specify first point here and uh, you can see that we ha also have option to enter line late like this and you can see same time we can enter angle like this well all these options available because of our dynamic input well it, it, if it's off you can see that we can't see any any tooltips or any parameter field on the right side of the cursor we can enter and draw our line but we can see option that can help us to enter a parameter of the line and then let's also see what additional settings this tool has or maybe how we can customize this tool that's why let's click on right click on the icon and click on dynamic input settings well you can see that here we have three main options that we can check or uncheck and in the same time you can see here settings every feature has own settings that we can customize all of them but we will not go so deeper and and we will see that how this tool works uh, well let's begin from first enable pointer input and uh, let's uncheck it and click ok then let's call line and you will see that we can't see any fields on the right side of the cursor but if you will click you will see that we can see line late well let's again go to dynamics input settings and check enable dimension input okay call line and let's draw you will see that we can't see any dimensional lines right here because we uncheck dynamic dimensional input here well let's enable pointer click ok and let's begin drawing you can see we can still enter parameters like this but we can't see any dimensional line that making our drawing more faster and more easier gone back and let's check this one well and also we can uncheck dynamic prompts and if you will uncheck show command prompts and command input near the cross chair you will see that we can see we can still see fields to enter some parameters into that field but we can see this command that aftercut asking us to do ne specify next point M well most of the time we can uncheck this uh, parameter because uh, we can draw without it let's go back and uh, again here we have another check additional tips with the command prompting well this option also we can't see any parameter if we uncheck this parameter show command prompting then we can see show additional tips command on the right side of the other corner well as you can see this tool very useful tool try to use this tool in your drawing more because if you are a new beginner maybe for you it will not so easy but after some time it will help you draw more faster and more easier well that's all for this tool please visit our website mgtools.com to join our community forum and to find more useful tutorials and much more thanks for watching bye